Welcome, I'm Roseanne and this is Real Life Tuesday. Have you heard of the expression, your body is your temple? More so than ever before, I have really been feeling the importance of this um, phrase. Our physical well-being is so intimately connected to our spiritual well-being and vice versa. I uh, have known many beautiful souls in human form that have focused a lot, if not all of their time, on their spiritual development to the point that they've neglected their physical well-being. And um, I'm really feeling right now, in particular, the energies are increasing around us literally on the planet and they are here to remind us that our physical well-being is vital right now more so than ever before there's also a lot of um people that have been making comments that they are wanting to or struggling to connect more with their guides with their higher selves just feeling that connection to source or god and um they're reaching higher and higher and i'm here to suggest that perhaps what we need to be doing more so is focusing again within and focusing on our physical bodies also Another key thing in there is um, grounding, really being connected to our human experience and our earthly bodies is, is so vitally important to have that connection with our higher selves and guides and source and God, whichever way you'd like to um, phrase it. And the um, one of the key messages that I've come to comprehend over the past few months is that um, if there is anything that is not working well within our physical bodies, it is actually going to be a blockage um, to that higher connection. So once again, it's um, a really important time right now. And I, I feel and, and I've heard from others that in particular, November and onward um, of 2021 that we're in right now, this is going to be coming up more and more. So if you're feeling um, these little nudges to take better care of yourself physically, uh, it's a good indication that this is one of the key messages that is for you. So um, things like, uh, how are you feeling fueling your body? Uh, are you moving your body? How are you moving your body? Uh, you know, how are you, are you loving your body? What do you need to do right now to heal yourself? What is needing that healing energy? And there's lots of different things you can do. You know, a lot of different topics I've covered um, over the uh, months and years, different things like that are fairly basic, you know, sleep, water, what kind of water are you drinking? Um, you know, what is the fuel that you are putting into your body? Food, is it clean? Is it, and, and what I mean clean is, you know, free from uh, toxic pesticides and things like that. Um, how much uh, nutrients are you getting within your food? And, um, you know, how much, uh, you know, for lack of better words, junk are you putting into your body? So these are things that you and only you can determine um, where your, you know, balance is within uh, physical health and well-being. And it's something that you may right now really need to take a good look at. So focusing on making these positive changes within your physical body will allow your frequency, your vibration to rise up. And that's going to also open the communication pathways to your higher self and all these other wonderful, um, you know, energies that are of a much higher frequency. Right now, with all of these higher energies that are coming in, 
they are here to help support your healing journey. So take this uh, Real Life Tuesday reminder to really look at what you're doing with your physical well-being and see where you can make these changes. If you are uh, needing any guidance, please reach out to me. I'm happy to uh, help make suggestions for helping to remove, you know, the toxins that may be in your household, uh, you know, helping to supplement with, uh, you know, true pure nutrients that are from whole foods so that, um, you know, it can help compensate for some of the lack of nutrients that are in our food system right now. And, um, you know, meditation, walking, um, mindfulness, all of these things also help with your physical well-being. Uh, but you do have to really think of the basics right now and look what part of your body is calling out to you right now. You know, close your eyes and let your body speak to you. What does it want to tell you right now? And work on that. Make that your focus in the coming months. I hope this was helpful. And once again, if you have any questions or would like some guidance on any of the nutrition side of things, I'm happy to help. And uh, you can uh, reach out to me through my website, reallifechanges.com. And I will be there to uh, help you on this healing journey.